is that how you make other people feel is what they remember about you. People forget what you said. People will forget what you did. People will never forget how you made other feel. Speaking personally, I can connect my experience working here at the Ben Elementary with how people made me feel. I was pretty new at my job when I first started working here. And probably, well not probably, I know I made some silly mistakes, which we all sometimes make. Nevertheless, the people that I met and worked with here at this school, and many of them are still here, some who have become my lifelong friends, or who were students and may now have children of their own attending the school. They were so supportive, so patient, so helpful, so kind, that it made me feel like I could do the difficult job of being a principal. That it made me feel that I could be good at it. And it went on to have a long career in education that, I was, that I'm very proud of. Some of you know that I met my future wife here, Sandra Luther, who is from Verdun. She died in the whole Verdunner. She was a principal here at Verdun Elementary. And she taught me, and she continues to teach me, what is most important in life, that people will forget what you said. People might forget what you did. But people will never forget how you made it. As I said, it's wonderful to be back in this building 20 years on. And after having retired last year from my job as principal of the Christian School Board, school board I've taken on a new role in helping with the Heart and Hands Clinic, as many of you know about. And it's terrific to be able to come back to this community, community that gave me an opportunity in my life. And wonderful to have a new chance to make a contribution school and move out into the world, you will encounter many challenges and face many difficult decisions as Ms. Kirko mentioned during her address. Remember that you were taught by all your experiences here. Remember the people who made you feel cared about, who celebrated with you when you accomplished something who made you feel good about what you learned and the skills you developed. Remember how well those people here inspire you because they will continue to do that. They will continue to be an inspiration to you long after you've left the elementary. People will forget what you said. People will forget what you did. But people will never forget how you made them feel. Remember to be positive and to show respect for others. It will help you to overcome any obstacles and build the faith build your faith in the belief that people can accomplish great things. When you show that respect, your abilities will flower, and as I say, you will be successful at what you try to do, and your dreams will be fulfilled. Graduates, I urge you to keep in mind that your community is important. The strength of any community depends on what its people are willing and able to do to help support it. I've experienced in my own life the very deep-rooted and strong sense of community here in Vidal. And people I know are willing to give freely and generously of whatever they have, especially their time, their effort, and their energy. As you leave Vidal Elementary, as you leave the school behind, think about ways that you can give back. Maybe as a volunteer, as we heard over mentioned that in her address as well. Maybe by finding another organization that you can support and help in the metro school. Maybe you can come back for the next month. That's volunteer. I encourage you to find ways to help others and as they say, give back to the community that has served you. You will find it rewarding to have you. People will forget what you said. People will forget what you did. But people will never forget how you did it. Boys and girls, 
Remember that respect? Respect for and service to others is really what that quotation I have been repeating this evening is all about. And if you think about it, this is exactly what you've learned here as students at the And it will help you to be successful as you go on to new challenges. It will help you to find satisfaction throughout your life. And most importantly, it will help you to make a positive difference in the world. Boys and girls, graduates of 2024, congratulations.
The certificate of distinction for achievement in physical education goes to Katie. to 
to twig things at stores that to buy, hopefully, maybe a guitar. If not a guitar, a musical instrument. So this is a very, very special award. Um, and uh, I, would, uh, I would like to call Miss Elizabeth up to present this new award, which is called the Michael Little Martin Music Award for outstanding musicianship and dedication to learning music. With this award comes a $250 gift certificate to Twig Music Store. I would like to congratulate Jackson Ojai. Acknowledging her 
future academic endeavors, this award goes to Emmett.
on the last day of school, we would all go outside and wave off the buses with these white, white kerchiefs. And uh, the whole staff would be out there, except for me, because I was crying. Because I was so sad that my students were leaving. And like grade six, they don't come back, right? It's not like you can other grades where they come back. And now here I step before you guys with your principal, and I say goodbye to you. I know I'll see you tomorrow, but... Uh, <laughs> goodbye till tomorrow, and then after that, good luck. You're always welcome back here. This is your home. You're always welcome here. And I have so much confidence that you all are going to go out and do wonderful things. Thank you so much to the families, the loved ones, the parents, the extended families. Thank you so much to the staff. You guys are amazing.